All right, so welcome back. Hoping you guys are having a fabulous day. Today, I wanted to talk about this real quick before we go into the upcoming week. Um, being again, this is when I'm recording this on Sunday, right? With this week, we should have a content update. All that should go down um, with the helm banner specifically, right? If you look at it, this banner is concluding in like what two, three days, four days. What is it? It is two days and 14 hours left. So in two days and 14 hours, guess what? Yes, Helm is gone. Helm is leaving. Goodbye. Sayonara. If you got her, you got her. If you didn't, it is what it is. She will get added to the standard banner in the future. So keep that in mind. But with the update, not only will we most likely be getting Lapless, or however you want to say it, um, we're also going to potentially, potentially, let me, let me, let me say this now, right? This got delayed. This Wildcat Engine event, the, the cooperative event, it got delayed. So I don't know if they're going to also push this back. But they did mention that this is supposed to be dropping in this week or the next one. So again, just keep this in mind. This was mentioned a while ago. Um, so I don't know if anything's changed. Remember, a lot has changed since when they initially said this. The game launched and then proceeded to have a plethora, a plethora of bugs. The amount of bugs this game has is insane. Like, we're getting, like the game is getting cold over on Reddit. We're getting the game cold officially now. This is what people are doing. Nikkei, goddess of bugs. Like, look at that, dude. I've never <laughs> seen that. We're getting we're getting slandered on uh, on Reddit, boys. But uh, with it, today I want to talk about this show it to you. This is a uh, an old notice they put out, which it's now approaching the time to when it should drop. Let me show it to you. So again, this is the developer notes that they did launch um, at the beginning of the game. And as mentioned, it's been a lot of time since this. 1103 is a while ago. It was 17 days. It might be like that's only two weeks, a little bit more than two weeks. What are you what are you talking about? But since then, the game dropped. The game had bugs. The game had delays. The game had has had a lot of stuff happening. Um, so I don't know if they're still on track to release this. But I think they are. So in this entire thing, we we already I already broke this down in like a separate video a while ago. But 60 main chapters, 62 playable characters. We have all those for the launch. But the one thing that they mentioned in the future of the game, unions will allow commanders to develop alliances with other players. In addition, a union shop where you can um, upgrades, you can purchase stuff and all of that. People have been asking me, yo, why can't I purchase anything? Why can't I get that currency and like a lot of it? What's happening there? And guess what? The reason is they are supposed to give you another mode where you can actually obtain those coins. The main method of attaining coins for the union shop will be through union raids, a piece of content we currently don't have. It's viewable in game, but we don't have it. And then if you were to look at it, if you load into game, right, you go into the game and you check right here. It clearly says union raid, but you can't actually do anything with it. The server is under maintenance and that doesn't work. If you click union shop, that'll work. If you click union shooting range, that'll work. But this is currently not a piece of content they have in the game because they plan to basically launch it later. It is also seasonal when they say that. They, may, like, they mainly mean maybe it's a weekly thing, a monthly thing. Uh, I don't know, every two weeks you get it. I don't know how that's gonna work, but I'm guessing like the way this mode is, I'm guessing, I have no idea, but like you damage it like uh, with your entire union, how much damage you actually do to the boss, and then you move out your day and see, you know, if you compare against other alliances or unions or whatever. I'm guessing that's the entire play with this entire thing, but this is a piece of content that's in the game exists, but you can't play it just yet, which means it's coming soon. And they already told us it is coming soon. So that's pretty cool. But they do say this. Union raids will be a seasonal content centered around a boss with the season first beginning at the end of November. I'm pretty sure this month is November. So yes, this is dropping real soon. Again, we're on the 20th right now. Uh, when they say the end, they could easily push this next week after the maintenance then. Or this week's maintenance. We're getting an entire content week this week being lapless. That's going to happen most likely as soon as Helm ends. So I'm going to stand on the fact that they most likely have planned it for this. Again, they might push it next week, like next week's the actual content week. Um, if they want to like do a character release and a content release and a character release and a content release. If they want to do it that way, then it'll work out. Um, unless it's delayed again till December. We'll see that, but it's supposed to be dropping here. We'll provide more additional information regarding Union Reigns at a later date. Um, we also have once the players uh, have had time to adjust the following game's initial release. We have big plans for unique story events coordinated um what is it operations which is the mini game or the uh co-op game we just got i read the mini game here and said it but yeah we just got the co-op event they have mini games planned and other various events these features will be rolled out sequentially and we hope that it will provide players with greater rewards and new experiences so again that's basically what they said about the upcoming area of uh, of the game and what we're looking forward to i basically think we got a mini game being like the the current event we have i don't know if that counts but coordinated operations that's obviously the same name of co-op Unique story events we haven't gotten yet, I don't think. Unless again, this instead, what I'm like the, the end event we have right now. I think maybe that's a that's a story event, and we have more mini games and other various events to look forward to. Uh, but there is that. The rest of the article really didn't give us much information for the future. Just mainly things they had planned for launch. Um, so that is there, right? So that's that's basically how they did it. Again, you'll have union raids soon, so don't worry about that. And again, there's also this, right? So I pulled up my video here when I initially made this. Um, this was from the uh, so Pridewind dropped like the KR notes, and they had all the stuff that they like gave information on i then went today to like check it if they still have it and prime removed all of it they removed like the main area of pvp where they left everything else so maybe i don't know what happened there but with it right so initially there was a planned pvp mode in this game okay 
Um, and it, there still is one. It, we're, we're always we were all speculating it also. Uh, but they do have a plan to name something arena and have a sort of PvP esque type thing. Again, we didn't know how it was going to play out or anything about it. But this was the shop, right? So. I'm guessing in the future they're going to try to uh, do something with PvP. The second biggest uh, surprise, this shop confirms the existence of PvP in Nikkei. There are no details about how PvP will look in the game, considering how the gameplay is unique compared to other gacha games, but at least we know it exists, okay? And then again, they give like the shop here and what it looked like. Um, and the breakdown was like you had the manuals over here, you have a bunch of equipment, um, basic things right here, the, uh, what is that, the box that gives you the manuals also, right? But that's what they gave, that, that was the entire thing. So there was a PvP mode initially, planned again i don't know if that's gonna ever drop if that's actually gonna be a thing that will drop in the future you look at it also seo is recently uh, dropped today and with that they also mentioned like before the launch before anything else they did say that we have a pvp mode coming in the uh the near future and when they said near future they basically meant like two three months um following the release of the actual game so maybe with this is the same way they actually plan it in the future in like a month or two but um again i don't know pvp is a very questionable thing a lot of gotcha games that add it uh, they always go down the wrong way of adding it. They add it in a way where it's like super whale heavy. Uh, you can't compete. You can't do anything. Or they add it in a way where it's too laggy to actually do anything. Or the rewards are just not worth the time. Or if the rewards are too worth the time, it's then whale heavy, right? So both ways it stands. How will PvP work in this game? And maybe this is scrapped. Maybe that's why it's removed from the Pride Rune site. Um, they just don't plan it anymore. They don't want to talk about it anymore. It's gone. Screw it. PvP is no longer a thing they have uh, in the works. But that is something in the future that you can look forward to. Um, and again, if you like PvP, this is great for you. If you don't like PvP, then just move about your day and ignore this because, um, I don't know, for this type of game, I, I don't see how it'll work. I see it like a PvE sort of thing where it's like, you know, PvE, PvP, like you go against, uh, it's like a race basically, right? Coordinated operation, but more PvP oriented. You race to damage, right? So do the much, uh, like the most possible damage you could. And then whoever wins, wins. So that makes more sense, but I don't know how PvP would actually work in this game. It's a very, as they said, unique game. How would that work? I don't know. You let me know. You you think about it. But again, I'll leave you with this. The hero debut we just recently got for Laplace. She will be dropping soon. I can't wait for her to see uh, like the entire like skills and all that. We might get that tonight actually, or tomorrow night. Um, it's two days and fourteen hours to like the banner actually leaves, and they tweeted it like twenty four hours before Helm dropped. So maybe tomorrow night we get skills and all that. Tonight we get like the initial image, and tomorrow night we get like the skills. If the skills drop. I'll, uh, I'll cover that when that uh, when that happens. But again, that's currently it. Laplace soon. Um, potentially, Union Raids will start up soon, so you can finally get that currency if you're looking for it. And then again, when it comes to PvP, that's in the near future or maybe the long future. We don't know when that's going to drop, but that is a plan for the game. They have more events and more things planned. And I really hope, again, on the side note of all of this, I hope that they squash the bugs. I really do. That is something that really needs to happen. The game is great. It's a great game. I'm enjoying every second of it. But some of the characters aren't working. Some of the entire kits aren't like made to be the way they are and they're just not kicking off properly they're not working properly right so it would be great if they can uh, iron out the fixes first before getting out the content that'll be great and i'll be fine if they delay any of the content in order to fix it because again you know people are getting really mad at the game for the reason of bugs and i understand it you summon for a character the character's not working the character the game's not loading properly things are crashing yeah it's uh it's a problem so hopefully they can get that uh ironed out hopefully so with it though i'll catch you the next one have fun stay safe peace out everyone enjoy the rest of your day that's been it for me yeah, just wanted to talk about that real quick. Hopefully you enjoyed it.